I've decided to show you this case where a customer has sent me this controller when I checked it had a password people I don't know so anyway this is a challenge I have to face uh, I've checked online that uh, you can actually reset it uh, using exactly the same controller which is about $50 so I could get another controller and do this copy the firmware from the other one to this one but I don't want to spend fifty dollars and what I'm gonna do is to just go through all these three, digit, three digits variations which is up to 999 and I think I'll be successful hopefully I don't miss the right number so I'm going to go through this and I'll speed the video so you can witness that I've actually done it. So so far I came until 240 42 actually but because I don't know which direction I was going I just checked 240 as well. So now I have to go 43. So I came up with this little algorithm. I'll show you. Now I'm going in the forward direction, right? Watch. Now because there is no zero after nine, it doesn't just become zero. And going back to zero is time consuming. I decided to go 59 and this third digit I go all the way down okay so 57 so this algorithm allows me to save some button clicks so now I go 60 and I have to try 60 then I go 61 and this time I'm going forward. <laughs> now we actually have to go back to zero because we're going to try 300. Next number is 500. We make sure we test one 500 and then 510 
and then 11. question is spending like an hour trying all these pin code possibilities actually worth the $50 is it what do you think it's like making $50 an hour that's a good salary I think so so I'm gonna go through all these numbers Yeah, 550. It's unlocked. Wow, it's unlocked. How to turn on the light? I forgot. Okay, now you can see it. <clears throat> 550. wonderful I'm very happy it took about 35 minutes now I'm going to show you the that's the controller I'm trying to install on that bike so I'm just going to go through all of these settings to actually remove the password P settings I don't remember what they meant P5 is the last one after long press up and down buttons we go to C settings and I think it was C9 C9 we set it to 0 and that gives us no password protection. We keep the middle button, long press, and that saves the settings. That's it. We can turn it off. And next time we check, next time we check, it turns on without password. no password yeah I think I need a new controller I mean this controller not LCD I just saved $50 and some time actually this is a cheap electric bike it has a problem the problem is it has a really small tiny controller it's a uh, low quality and it's low power so when it has too much load this thing gets heated up too much wasting a lot of battery power in heat wasting a lot of power turning a lot of battery useful battery power into actually uh, heat energy so we don't want that uh, instead I want to try to install a more powerful controller I could improve the battery efficiency on this cheap bicycle I'll make another video about this one so for now I just put this thing back we could use it meanwhile before I fix it I'll give it a small check the light is on it's working I can come here so the light is on it's working now so I give it a small test okay it's working 